go. <clears throat> so, Mike, can you tell me a little bit about how the United Rage uh, project started? Yeah. So, um, at, it, it all started in 2016, right? Um, I, I reached out to some of my friends who I used to play with in, uh, in the Rage Tribute. Um, and then I asked them if they wanted to do a, a cover of Prophets of Rage. Because that, that, that was when uh, Prophets of Rage was just starting, right? Right. Uh, mm -hmm. at, and that, during that time, uh, those uh, guys were already in different places. The drummer was, it, his name is Taka, he was in Japan, and the bass player was uh, Mike Guy, he's in Nashville. So I asked them, hey, this, this sounds dope, you know, like it, I actually thought it was Rage Against the Machine, like coming back, but then, you know, eventually finding out it wasn't them. But anyway, um, I asked him and he said, yeah, why not? So, and then I, uh, I was looking for a guitar player. Um, I remember one of my friends uh, mentioned this guy named uh, Mike Svensson. Then I reached out to him through... Uh, Facebook and then you know basically said the same thing hey do you want to do this song and he said yeah so that's how it started it's from the Prophets of Rage song the self-titled Prophets of Rage and then uh, you know after a few days of posting that we saw there's uh, it's, it's getting a lot of traction right and then so I decided hmm why not make more right and so uh, I said Let's do Rage Against the Machine. And the next song after Prophets of Rage was Know Your Enemy. Hmm. And uh -huh. uh, but but in that time I had this idea of you know shifting players and having different players from other countries. So yeah, that's how it started. Um yeah, I guess uh we were one of the first ones who uh who did like mm -hmm. the quarantine type of uh, yep. videos, you know. Mm. Uh, but yeah, it was a it was a great uh, it was a great experience to have, you know, different different uh, takes, but you know, also from different countries. Um, yeah, and then eventually deciding to meet up and maybe do it live it was some some of the some of the people uh who saw that it was actually them who suggested to do it uh live and then right. that's why i reached out to people and he eventually became a, a, a tour <clears throat> so clint when did you join the project actually uh when jm was playing drums which which was a uh, bullet in the head and then that's the first one. That's my entry to United Rage. And then after that, we talked. And then we, you know, we did the show. We did the mini tour. We played in Hong Kong. And then we, I played uh, with the, uh, for United Rage in Manila as well. And then after that, when we went back, to the U.S., me and, and me and Michael just talking here and there, texting, my messaging, like, what? and then I, he has, we, he, well, we had a show during that time because I'm going to fly to L.A. to do a show with him, and then that's when we had that talk, like, he, he told me, uh, uh, I don't want to play, play live anymore if you're not the guitar player, and then I told him the same thing, I don't want to play live anymore if you're not the singer if if we're doing like rage stuff mm. you know and during that time that's the time when we decided that we're gonna do an original original yeah. song like original song and, and then, then we, we, uh, to get a tattoo like my right butt cheek says tenak and then yeah it's just d <laughs> it's just d yeah, yeah. kind of like that <clears throat> So this, uh, so your pro United Rage actually, you guys were using Zoom and stuff before the Zoom was cool, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I guess it was his, uh, it was Clint's wife who, uh, 
who yes. made the idea, right? Um, yes, my wife. I'm, it's, uh, I gotta, you gotta blame my wife. Because when the, my wife first saw the video of Know Your Enemy of United Rage, and then she was like, why are you not there? Why are you not the guitar player of that one? Wow. And I was like, uh, yeah. And I was like, and they already have a guitar player. And then, like, when I saw, like, I don't know what video, I can't remember what video. I, I remember the other Quint that played with United Rage. I think oh, yeah. it was People of, the, People of the Sun or something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then I was like, oh, maybe I can uh, talk, to the, talk to Mike again to maybe I could, not again, but I can reach out to Mike to uh, play guitar. And then I talk, I reached out to him and he's like, can you do both in the head in one week? Cause we need to, we, we need to, we, they already have like a published date of when they're going to publish the, the video. And then it's like, yeah, let's do it. You want to okay. do it right now? I'll do it right away. <laughs> and then, yeah, after that, there goes like, after bullet thing was freedom. And then freedom after freedom, what wake up, and then so on and so forth. Right. Yeah. yeah. So 